If you've never worked with basswood, you're in for a treat. You won't find another wood that is this straight grained without knots. If you didn't know any better, you wouldn't even think this is wood. It looks like plastic or foam, but it's wood. Straight as an arrow and stable. So what did people use this wood for? The patterns that made these castings were probably made from basswood. Here's a wooden pattern that could have been made from basswood. I just used plywood, but you can see all the grain in this one. The dimensions on this pattern are not that critical, but if you're making gears for an engine or back in the day, a locomotive, you're gonna want a material that is straight, stable, and has no knots. Pattern shops all over the world have used this and still do. Not near as much because you can buy foam that is stable and straight. So if you ever looked at these old castings and said, how did they make them? The pattern makers of the day would have made these templates just a little larger. So when the metal cooled off, it would be the right size. So then the parts that had to be really precise were milled off on milling machines or metal lathes. Now you're starting to see the value of basswood. If you've never seen it before, or you didn't know what they used to do with it, now you can really appreciate the straight grain and no knots. So next time you've got a project where you wish your wood didn't have any knots and it was super smooth, super straight, and super stable, you'll recall back to this video and start looking for some basswood. Even the wood chips have a nice texture to it. So here's one last look of this super clean, straight wood. Amazing, isn't it? Hey, I really appreciate your time and thanks for watching.